today is indeed bright and fair and we all have to do or rejoice and be glad in it <laughs> it's actually a sunny day here in lagos nigeria welcome back to sale with me Shostly mimi where you get the gist i see they do waiting i see they hurt you know there's no sleeping on a bicycle in this channel if you snooze you do what you lose so guys earlier today when i posted one of my videos i said today smells like it's gonna be a violence day <laughs> and guess what the mouthpiece of the oracle is actually right mimi Shostly mimi is so damn right us it is actually a violence day today and let the violence begin because we are all in for it but before we begin have you subscribed to my channel if you've not kindly do the needful okay darling thank you so talking about um Yvonne's homecoming guys are uh, the Yvonne stars are rejoicing as Yvonne homecoming her billboard is all over the place in Akwai bomb like in three towns in Akwai bomb Yvonne's billboard are there congratulations Yvonne we can't wait for tomorrow so guys Sabang had his interview with um the city fm today you know but the only thing i can just want to, i would say about tabang interview is that tabang said he wants to be cordial with everybody he has anything with to do in the house but he doesn't want to continue with anything called ship there is no situation ship anywhere anymore that he just want to be cordial cordial focus on his future and wish and create better things for himself so for those shippers kindly be coming down i mean why he was asked about the to kiss and kill and marry we all know how, how problematic such question is he was asked to choose between kosi nelisa and olivia that is kiss kill or marry and tabang said no 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 no. you guys shouldn't put me on the spot so please i beg that he is not gonna do in fact in us when they mentioned the names he was like kiss 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 you know he doesn't want to ahala he's seen the dragon already so he no get strength at all okay so you know yesterday i posted a video and pictures of black boy homecoming how massive it was yeah so you know and i showed you guys black boy's mom right and his mom is actually a black beautiful woman okay you know black is beautiful and then this is yaya praising black boy's mom she said this is why black men will always be the most beautiful creation god has ever created because they come from beautiful black woman see fine face and this god black boy blushing as he replied if there is he said if there is one thing you're good at is making me blush to me you know we africans we don't joke with our parents at all especially our momsy all right also black boy is still wondering that he said the internet will never see my tears again post bbt show also me one minute after arriving at the airport in jaws he's trying to say that when he left the house he was like the tears he, he, he cried in the house was the last tears you guys are gonna see i be he has left the house people will not see anything not until yesterday the jaws people made him cry but this time around it is tears of joy all right guys hmm let's go we are getting close to the violence level though because guys hey, hey okay so olivia olivia tweeted this she said i am tired of being an adult can i be your baby you know you know sometimes the stress of being an adult self would make you think like ah i beg i beg i beg can you just go back to baby i have once thought about that meanwhile talking about olivia ha guys they've been dragging this baby girl because i don't know how to put it some certain fans because i'm not going to mention any fans have been dragging olivia that is the lee hives and um the k force what is the reason what did they do they said that they, because of they say that they always carry hashtag that they will carry hashtag and for everywhere and be asking for retweets 100 retweets 1 million retweets you understand that that does not sell a brand that any brand that see people retweet um a fave um this thing page like one one person will retweet they will be retweeting the same thing that it does not say good of their their brand okay that people will be like oh so it's the same people doing the same thing all over again and they've been attacking olivia saying oh they're attacking olivia and kanaga jr actually saying that it is not all about saying the fashionista, the this, the that, you know, or that's trying to say this, the fashionista of the year, this is not the fashionista of the year. That if you continue doing that, no brand will take you. And I was not looking at people dissing these two housemates. You are dissing the two of them. Are you doing well more than them? Our brand, have they not signed endorsement deal? What are you saying though? Now, talking about fashionista, hey, <laughs> hey. So, Ipeleng today posted a picture that she 
ate and left no crumb. Hmm. But guys, trust me, instead of praising her or admire her beauty and just move away, trust me. Now, you know there are some bad belly. There must be bad belly everywhere. As some person started saying, what does she even do since she left Biggie's house? Is it just to take pictures and come out and snap pictures? Now, my question to you people is, is it that some of you hate seeing this housemate happy? I want to understand. Or is it that some of you are saddest? I really want to get it, okay? That's this housemate. You know, some of this. I told you guys that this we are all human beings. There are some words that will get to us, okay? And they were even flagging a rumor. They were saying that Ipeleng once said that that she is just like only the housemate that is not busy. Okay, and remember in the house, I keep saying this, Ipeleng is one housemate that lacks self-confidence. Okay, and she is one housemate I would say would let what get to her easily. Though I hope she has grown over that. It is not actually easy to, to grow over that. But why would you come under somebody's beautiful picture? Okay, which you will know that in many ways that person find past you die. Then you come there, they, they yarn trash saying things. Is the only picture, picture she comes to take? Is the only this, my dear? That is how some insensitive, insens how will I put it? I sometimes I try to watch my words so I don't use so much harsh word. Okay, I don't know how some people reason that they will have to say that to someone. Okay, and you know, this housemate see all these things. That is what pisses me off. Guys, be taking it easy on this housemate. I beg. All hands are not equal. Please. Now say this for yourself. Apart from taking pics, what else has she been doing since she left the house? I just asked him, please. No one should attack me. I just wish to know. She said she is the only one that is not busy. She, this one I replied again. Ah, oh, really? Shame. She could do so well with skincare brand ETC. Now in your mind, you care. That's why you're asking. Do you know some questions are really not necessary? It is really not necessary. Okay, the way you even ask it, say, what has she been doing since she left the house? Like, be, apart from taking pictures, what does that mean? Anyways, let's just go and still on the violence. So, a few days ago, Yemi Crest posted this picture of him on this leather jacket, looking all penguin and sweet. Okay? <laughs> Guys, you know, you know how I've been posting Yemi Crest and be talking about him, okay? So, today, um, some blogs were like, um, Yemi or Miracle, you know all those kind of questions, who would you choose? Then some netizens started attacking Miracle. They said Miracle is a follow follow. So because of Yemi Kress wore that leather jacket, so Miracle went to wear his own. That what kind of thing is this? That's all the things he had in mind for Yemi since, um, since he left the house. Cool. That Miracle still carried Yemi on his head like Gala. That is why he could copy everything Yemi do. But guys, they do forget that this is just a wrong accusation on Miracle's side. Miracle actually wore this before Yemi. Miracle actually wore this clothing before Yemi. Like he wore this jacket before Yemi. Yemi just wore his own. Was it not two days ago or when? I even posted the picture as at the day he wore it. Was it not yesterday? Then you're coming for Miracle who wore this like two weeks or how many weeks ago? That he is copying Yemi. Oh goodness. I just noticed one thing. That you people do not like certain housemates. And for the fact you do not like them. You have to carry their name any which way you want. Miracle have been dragged for advising wrongly. Doing this and doing that. All because of the hatred you guys really have for the guy. But it is what it is. But just know that Miracle is not copying anybody. Because some people carry it on verified news. And just they just post it like that. Without even knowing anything about it. They just let their hatred for their for the, some certain housemates control them. And which is a very bad thing. Theme. So be taking a chill pill and be calming down. He was said, at this rate, Miracle won't see me D. You can't tell me otherwise. It is giving up sex as girlfriend. You see? How is he giving up sex as girlfriend? Now, okay, because of Yemi wore that. And you now think Miracle went because of all, all because of Yemi wore that. He now went to purchase it, buy it and wear it because of Yemi. You people should be coming down with your heart too. And he also said, is he not getting too old for all of this? 25 be doing like 18 years old. And I am very sure that after you finish casting Miracle and saying some certain things about him, then when you get to realize that your, your judgment over him was actually wrong, you would actually, maybe your sense, you just, but your pride your arrogance will not let you realize that oh you were actually wrong this in this particular person in your mind you have this somebody and do you know one thing about this set of people when you attack them back <laughs> they can't even withstand one attack 
Like when you talk to them, they can't even withstand it. That is one thing with such person. Una day they yarn what about people way better persona. June Hogg said, I will always applaud Yemi, Yemi's fans for keeping shippers away from him and his brand. Look at him winning with no yeah yeah boats, dragging him down or staining his white. Yes, of course, the Craig's Force, I have always applauded them too for how they stay on their lane, happy Yemi, and Yemi is actually winning silently. But what I do not like is this comparison. I do not like it at all. What is it for? What is it for? These housemates are doing well in their own ways. And you shouldn't expect all of them to come out all publicly and start saying that, telling you about their day-to-day -day activities. And just know you must not know about everything. Because this attack on Miracle is just so unnecessary. Okay? All right, guys. It is actually a sunny day here. I don't know about the weather from your end. Okay? So, I am about to sign off with my full chest. Okay? I'll see you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. Mimi really do care. Bye.